How's it going, everybody? Bulb here, playing a horror game called Crimson Hunt. Well, another apish box games, but I missed this one. So, we're jumping right in. Time to play. What could a Crimson Hunt be? None shall truly fathom the bareness of the light until they hath endured the trials of the night. Oh, <laughs> I kind of like that. What is this, vampire? Werewolf? What, what exactly does this title mean? And what's with the poem? Hmm, now I'm intrigued. Maybe I'm a vampire hunter. <laughs> That'd be pretty cool. Well, it looks old-timey. Matthew, it's been three weeks since the plague descended upon our village. The plague? Well, that's not what I was expecting. All right, true. We gotta deal with the plague. Oh my. None of us could fathom the cause of this inception. Yet, many souls have perished. Damn, son. What is this, the Black Plague? My daughter, she was among the fallen. And now, my cherished wife. Aw, oh, dude. Brutal. Poor guy. He's living the, the sad times, man. The potion does not offer much help. But, if I venture into the village... If I go, I may not see her breathing again. But what choice do I have? Damn, dude. Brutal. Well, it's all black and white. I like that. I must go, but first, I'll look around my apartment and see what's going on in here. What are these? What the f- I have no idea what that is. Are you dead, lady? Ah, my dearest. I should compose her a letter. A paper can be found on the shelf. She's not dead yet, she's just sick. Okay. Compose a letter? I may rent a page from this book. Let's sit and set forth our words. I like <laughs> I love the way this guy talks. It's like ye old English. Okay, what did I write? Can I read it? My dearest, I had no choice but to venture into the village in order to find a cure for the plague that has haunted our family. I deeply regret leaving you, yet. I might not be able to exist. Your soul leaves me. I had enough eternal suffering for what has happened to our daughter. I shall return before sunrise. Yours truly, Matthew. Well, at least you left a nice letter, but I feel bad. Maybe you shouldn't leave. What if she dies and you're gone? This would be so depressing. All right, I'm just gonna venture into town, dude. I gotta find the cure. The village is far. I must set forth to my journey now. All right, where am I going? Okay, we got no sprint. Got no jump. My house is tiny. Okay, this definitely does feel like I'm living in like the 18th century. But what's gonna happen? I'm curious. I'm looking for a cure to a plague. Maybe there is no plague, it's just actually like vampires making everybody sick, sucking all their blood. Leaving everybody all drained. Alright. What the? It's a burned down house. But why? Here we go, here's a sign. What does this say? North Shades. What, is that where I live? I'm going to Reachville? Alright, we're going to Reachville. Ah, oh, shit. Reachville? Here we go again. Sounds like it could be a real place. Okay, Reachville it is. Let's go. I'm a nigh unto my venture to end to Reachville. Oh, I can sprint now. Never mind. Cool, cool. Mechanics being added as I play. I like it. Very cool. I actually kind of like the black and white. I've only played two games so far that have had black and white. Or maybe three. Not very many, that's for sure. It does make you feel like you're playing like either a really old-timey movie, or it just gives you that feeling that you are like far in the past. What has fallen upon this place? The plague has become stronger. Damn, Damn son, there's just offices everywhere. They're empty though. Wait a minute. Is everybody raising from the dead? I am a traveler from North Shades. I request to open the gates! Oh man! Oh! What the fuck? What is this guy wearing? I extend my humble gratitude for granting me passage. What is this guy wearing? The gatekeeper. Well, 
Tis rare to have visitors gracing our doorstep, especially from north. Verily, our food has rotten, and folks in these parts have diminished. Damn, son. This is starting to sound like Castlevania. Pray tell, what hath led you to our abode, traveler? Are you a merchant? I found myself in dire need of aid. I seek a remedy. My wife both face a dire and mortal affliction. I am in need of potions. Alas, we have none left. Those in aid. Salute death and pray with our God. Madness, I serve the same Lord, yet I have not come to such solutions. I would counsel you to hold thy tongue with, your, with care, good sir. Our parish priest, Father Benedict, may well cast you out for ill-spoken words. Why? Why? My what? apologies. Why? I mean no ill intent. I beg, grant me audience with your priest. Father Benedict is engaged in divine service. You might speak to Roland, second in charge. All right, gatekeeper. I like your armor. He's cool, man. Be a Dark Souls character. <laughs> All right, sir. What the fuck? Well, this place is a little bit spooky. Doesn't seem like there's so many dead here. But all the food's rotten. Who here wants to talk to me? You guys? Oh. Whoa. No. Can I go in here? No. Where do I go into the church? Big church? Okay, let's go talk to this guy. What do you gotta say, bud? Are you second in command by any chance? Or are you just burying bodies? You're just burying bodies over here. What's up, dude? What the? Dude, this guy's got a Fu Manchu. He's rocking it. What's up, dude? My apologies. I am Matthew from North Shades. Are thou named Roland? Is a traveler, Roland. You have ventured from a far land. Perhaps, why is that? My beloved one, she draws nigh to her death. I beg for aid. Ocean's remedy has not been kind to us. No purpose lies at that. Behold, young coffin strewn around. We even lack the means to give dead peace. Unburied corpses, though a graven concern, art thou vile as the curse upon us? What do you thou imply? What peril could surpass the, di the dreaded plague? A foul creature, which has shattered the coffins and stolen the lifeless husks. What? What? There is a creature. Uh-oh. It comes in the shroud of night to claim the townsfolk. As its quarry, I am a witness. The plague hath deceived your mind, good sir. Those words are folly, I assume. You are mistaken, traveler. As once a brave soldier who went for the Crimson Hunt. Crimson Hunt? What does you speak of again? Thy creature's blood. The survivor came to our town, cured from the plague. Alas, next day, in the shade of light, his body turned into flames. We believe the soldier hath taken blood, alas. Again, we have no more seek for that place. Art thou suggesting that beyond these walls exists a location where a creature's blood can be obtained to heal this plague? I am certain, and that is to be truth, good traveler. Won't you seek for aid for your beloved? I wouldn't offer my life for her sake, yes. I will venture outside the walls. Well then, rest for now. Seek the room new sanctuary. I shall visit you after dawn. All right. All right, Roland, I guess if you're gonna help me, I'm cool with that. I'm all right with that. Am I supposed to leave now, or do I just go hide somewhere? Where am I sleeping, huh? 
Can I go in here by any chance? Oh! Door! Here we go! That was the most hidden door I've ever seen! Alright, let's go. I want to see the Crimson Hunt! Please be a werewolf. Or a vampire. Or something unique? Oh! And a bat? Dude, I think it's a vampire. I think we're dealing with the vampire. I have slumbered many hours. Someone has visited my abode. What? Creature is of unholy nature. It despises our Lord, thus fears the Holy Cross. You shall have it with you, Matthew. Both I was spared of death because of it. Furthermore, garlic. Seek garlic outside and taketh with you. Its virtue helps as well. I have failed to consult you properly. Alas, I must seek hiding. As the creature strikes us at night, I must not survive to fight on the tomorrow. But assisting you is of a noble gift for today. Thanks, Roland. So where's my cross? Got a light. I like that. Where I needeth my holy cross. Gimme. Okay, thank you. Okay, I'm rested. I got a light. I got a cross. I need garlic? I gotta go defeat of it. Oh, hey! The, huh? What disturbance was that? I must investigate outside my abode. I did hear that. How do I use my cross? I must seek out Roland. Chance gatekeeper holds knowledge of that. Holy fuck, it's dark out here. Hello. Gatekeeper. Dun dun. Oh, he's been eaten. Cool. That's actually really cool. I like that. Okay, well... I can't talk to him. It's not giving me a prompt, so I just walk around and look for... Mr. Roland, are you here still? Or am I just gonna run face first into a giant vampire? I can't see dick all. Roland! Bud! You here? Bud? No? Hmm. Okay. Do I just go outside the gate? Maybe. Let's see. No? Do not go outside the gate. Alright. Then what? Am I supposed to click on the front gate that's all blocked off? Maybe. Let's see. This thing? There you go. Alas, a wooden portal seems to be barred from the other side as well. Okay. Then back here. Huh? So what? There's another gate. Yeah, okay. Clicking on this guy does nothing. I don't see anybody anywhere. Oh, ran into a corner. Come on! Where's this vampire? And or where's Mr. Roland Band? You still alive over here? <laughs> Son of a bitch, is he dead? Ah, uh, garlic! It shall take away the scent! Go flee! Garlic? Gimme! I got some garlic. Alright. The other gate is open. Oh no! I hear wings! He's coming! Run! Escape the vampire! Yes! Well, not yet. Why the creature is above me? I have to flee to the other side. I'm trying. I have a cross, though, and garlic. I should be fine, right? Beat his ass. I'll teach him a lesson. Fuck you, you vampire son of a bitch! Where the fuck am I going? Uh oh. Uh-oh, this is a maze. This is not looking good, Captain. Please don't run into a dead end. I'll be very disappointed. Damn it! No, did he catch me? Oh, no! Fuck you. I got garlic and a cross. Use it. Quick. Do something. Smack him with it. <laughs> Beat him up. What? Did I get captured? Um... What? Really? Where am I? Hath I stumbled across the lair? 
I must flee from this accursed place. Oh shit, he kidnapped me. God damn it, vampire. You son of a bitch. I don't have my light anymore. Do I still got a cross? What is this? What do you got? E. Take the key. The days of the plague. We faced a dire test when an ominous creature descended upon our humble village. Father Benedict proclaimed the entity to be an angel sent from the Almighty to save us. Alas, we were all deceived. We fed the creature, lured travelers from outside the village. Yet again, the plague swept through the neighboring lands, leaving us isolated. Faced with this grim reality, we started sacrificing our own kin to satiate the creature. My heart is heavy with the burden of our dark secrets, and this shall be my final words. And the captured traveler is awakened. He shall flee. Grasp the key, unlock the chest, hidden in the shadows, and find the salvation. Did I get a weapon? There's a there's a chest somewhere? Yeah, I got the key. What you talk about chest, huh? Got a weapon or something? Is that what you're saying? Did I like this? No. Okay, where's there a chest? I want my salvation, see? Yes? Open? Firstly, I saw she seeks thy something else that is hidden. What do you mean? Yes, here we go. Gimme, what is it? Crossbow? Yes! Alright, dude. Power to reload, and then I get to shoot. Let's go kill this son of a bitch! Fuck you, vampire! I'll show you who's boss. Okay, I'm ready for battle, I guess. How do you shoot? Not letting me yet. Hello? Huh. Hey, well, where is this guy? What is this now? Bolts? Did I take this? Ah, here we go. Wait, I want to read this first. Verily, my unknown parishioners hath transformed into the loathsome creatures, foul and wretched. I am in desperate attempt did feign gratitude towards the big evil that hath descended upon our village. I disguised it as an angel, for I comprehended that we all faced the, the perilous fate of being devoured alive, unless a sacrifice was made. I saved many in our village. Alas, the flying creature did exploit my parish. Now they roam the empty depths beneath the earth. What if one among them set in this vile sights upon me? Hence I fashion these arrows, their keen points blessed in the sacred waters of holiness, as my defense against the encroaching darkness. Father Benedict. Thanks, bud. Go kick some ass then. I got a holy crossbow now, you <laughs> son of a bitch. Finally! Are there many vampires or just one? I'm gonna assume many? What is this? This does kind of feel like a Dracula's castle. Pretty cool. Where's all the die beast? Whoa, he's tough. He's really tough, but he won't get off me. Hey! Back beast! You son of a bitch! Fuck, dude, what the hell? They're fast, dude. You gotta shoot them in the chin and run away. Yo, I killed one of them. more in here shit they're too fast what the fuck is this I don't know oh never mind oh yeah dude never mind I know how to play this now machine gun style you just gotta yeah <laughs> that's definitely not intentional but thank you thank you for letting me just rip reload and shoot at the same time oh that makes it manageable I don't care how fast these bastards are you can't defeat me! I am the ultimate warrior! Here to fight for justice and mankind! <laughs> Die, you fuckers! Dude, this is, this is so good! I'm having a blast here, dude! Vampire hunting! I love this! I gotta get this guy to freedom! He deserves to live! Don't worry, bud. I gotcha. We're gonna kill this fucker. Is there a big vampire somewhere? Is 
Damn it! I think I'm hurt. You bastards! What did I just pick up? How dare you hurt me! Man, they're like right in your fucking face, you bastard vampires! Ah, shit. I knew I'd go the wrong way eventually. Come on, dude. Time to get you to freedom, to safety. All right, gotta be this way. There's gonna be another. Oh, nope, it's not yet. Who's here? Another fucker? Don't be right around the corner. Man, this place is a goddamn maze. What the fuck is this? All right, true. All right, it just keeps going. <gasps> I never asked for this. There's a priest in here, and he's not bad. Hey, they talk to you? Oh, he's still alive. Verily, it seems that thou hast stumbled upon mine weapon. Well done. Yeah, of course. Silence, you fool! How could thou do such a treachery against your own? True, you're a bastard. Thou pitiful villager. I wrought that was requite for our very survival. Well, I don't care, dude. Can I shoot this guy? The creature would assume, would consume us all, had I not discerned the need for compromise. Aye, compromise. Thou didst salvage myself from the jaws of the creature, not else. Pretend not, my son of innocence. The stain of sin rests upon the hands as well. Thou hast slain my kin, taken the lifeblood of the creature. How are thy any nobler? They were beyond salvation. You failed them in prayers, and now you shall see the Almighty. Fuck you, dude. Slaying me would not halt the creature's wrath. Shall thou spare me? I can offer aid. I don't need your aid. This day, I received offer from a noble soul, who came to my aid in the hour of need. His name was Roland, and may he forever forgive thee for thy gravest actions. Oh! Yeah! Fuck this guy. Fuck you, dude. You got Roland killed? You're bastard. <laughs> Fucking prick. Let's go kill Dracula now. Where's the main big guy? I gotta fuck him up. Where is he? Come on, bud. I'll show you. I'm the vampire hunter. Right? Come on, where is he? Yeah, let's get him. What the? Oh my god! Did I not kill him? No way. Come on. Fuck you, dude. Dude, that's an awesome looking monster, though. In the name of God, perish, you foul creature! Shoot him! Keep shooting him, bud! Yeah! A really cool looking vampire, I gotta say. Very cool, dude. I like it a lot. Poor Matthew, dude. Is he just gonna fall to his death now? I, but he's. Yeah! We got him! But I'm gonna fall too. Fuck. Well, he's. Dead. We stabbed him with a cross! Yeah! I showed you, you son of a bitch! Awesome. But Matthew's dead too, and he didn't get the fucking potion to his wife. God damn it! But it's still a bad ending. Unless. Unless. He landed in a hay bale, he pulled an Assassin's Creed? Is that what you're showing me? Please. Where both mine eyes find themselves. How come I pray? Who art thou? Farmer? I am but a humble farmer on Wayfair. I chanced upon thee and brought, th brought thee hence. From where didst thou discover me? Hast thou glimpsed the place where I hailed? I heard a strange sound in the humble shack and found thee in a hayloft laying nearby. Yes, he pulled an Assassin's Creed. Thou dost speak fervently of the Northern Realm, as I guided thee here. Cool. Thou kind soul, I know not how to express my gratitude. How may I repay, repay thy kindness? Hey, good wayf 
Good wanderer, there's no need. My heart speaks volumes. That suffices for me. What a beautiful woman, thank you. You virtuous souls, both in our realm, tis a solace to meet one such as thee, noble one. Perhaps I can extend thee a, ma a meager offering of food. My abode lies nearby. I appreciate thy offer. I must hasten to my own kin before thy sun sets. Face thee well, kind farmer. May the almighty land lend thee his aid. Yeah, thank you, farmer. Do I get to go home now? I'm still alive. I shall finally gaze upon my cherished one. I don't know. I lack the power to accomplish such tasks. Henceforth. Uh-oh. She's gonna be di she's gonna be turned already. I lack the power to accomplish such tasks. Oh man. Wait, oh, I can't sprint anymore? Yeah, he's too hurt. I'm getting a bad feeling, dude. Don't tell me that this fucking the fucking wife is gonna be turned into a zombie. And then he's gonna have to kill her. No give her the potion, please. Give Make this good end. I did all this work and killed this vampire. Make a good end, please! Good end! What? I yearn to behold my daughter beyond my abode at the back. What? Oh, the grave. Wait, you're gonna use the potion to revive your dead daughter? I thought you are using it to heal your wife. Now I'm concerned. <laughs> what are you doing, you crazy man? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Huh? Okay. Just laying there beside the grave? So was he gonna use it or what? What? Verily, Matthew, in his final hours, was discovered by his lady wife as he departed from this world. He died! Why, dude? The potion, brewed from the creature's blood, was consumed by her, and, by some miracle, it mended her infirmities filled with hope she journeyed onto reachville but alas none of them did survive the trials that befell upon untattered by sorrow she pressed onward until she chanced upon the humble farmer who had sided matthew she extended her be benevolence to his kin thus replying repaying the kindness the scorched remains of the creature were discovered by the churchmen they lowered the creature from its place blessing the earth with the holy water and then they moved forward as the m mystery of its origins remained a secret matthew find found his final rest beside his daughter his devoted wife visited their graves each week till she too succumbs to the hands of time reaching the age of 70 her days were filled with noble deeds aiding the needy and spreading kindness that matthew had once exemplified Wow, well at least she got to live, but now I feel bad for Matthew. Poor guy. Poor dude. God damn it. But you know what? That was a really fun game. That was a great little story. I love me some vampires. The black and white aesthetic? Very cool. Hey, I always leave the games in the description. Definitely go play this one. It is awesome. It's definitely worth it. It has a little bit of everything for everybody. I wasn't even expecting that shooting part. Awesome. And fun. Very fun. Yeah. I definitely recommend. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like and a comment and subscribe for more. Hey, test me. I read and reply to every single comment. So shoot me one. Say hey, request a game. Say anything you want to say. It really helps out with the hope it in YouTube algorithm. And of course, thanks for watching. As always. Obi-Wan here, and peace out. Move the master of the dark, white tea legend leaves his mama in the realm of forest, he prevails, no fear, not the story of hell, yeah. In his in control Deepers tremble as he takes his toll The horrific jump scare, he stands tall Both the villains conquer of them all Yeah Open horrors, they